Hello? Yeah, the audio. Hmm? Auxiliary. Signal hello. Input in you need to sit down it. Hello.
Hi, good morning, everyone. Sorry I had to run here, so I'm a bit out of breath. <laughs> okay, um, thank you all for joining. My name is Upa, and this is my co-founder, Esther. We're from and online is Hannah. We're from Digital Grassroots. And um, our session today is Technology and Innovation for Gender Equality. In this session, it's a networking session. The main goals are to talk about the issues relating to technology and innovation for gender equality. It's a networking session, so we're not going to do a lot of presentation. In a bit, I'm going to hand over to Esther to talk about how the format of the session would go. And um, yeah, basically, we're going to analyze the main issues that surround technology and innovation for gender equality. We're here to talk about it from a very diverse perspective. We understand or the main essence of this session is to really dive into what are the main issues from our community, which is youth. Here at the IGF, it's very important for us to understand what these main issues are. We are a part, as digital grassroots, we are a part of the Action Coalition for Gender, for gender Equality by the UN Women. And as part of this Action Coalition, we have been doing a lot of work and committed to bridging the gender divide in ICT as a whole. And one of the ways of doing this is really analyzing what are the main issues that surround gender equality with regards to technology and innovation. So thank you very much for joining and I'm gonna pass it to Esther now, thank you. Thank you all so much for coming and yeah, thank you for your patience. We went to the wrong briefing room, so <laughs> sorry about that. But thank you for being here and as Ufa has shared, it's a very interactive session and we're here to network. And as digital grassroots, we are quite unconventional and we try not to get too staff, staffed up. And so we are going to have breakouts where we're going to meet each other to discuss like what are we doing in technology and innovation. Uh, so basically we have our brief introduction, like Ufa shared, we're, from, we're the only youth group in the Action Collision for Technology and Innovation for Gender Equality. And what we found is that what we found is that there is a very big divide between what happens at the high level and what happens at the grassroots. And part of this is because there isn't a lot of communication between what happens at the top and at the bottom. And for innovation to take place, it's very important that we include the grassroots and that we are able to communicate and talk to one another. So I'm trying to see how this would work because we are in a very, unflexible room, but um, we're going to get started and we're just going to have like two rounds of sessions where we're all going to get up and talk to someone we do not know, we did not come with, and share what we do in technology and innovation and gender equality because this is, after all, a networking session and we can't, we can't take up all the time and space. So we're going to get started and I'll just like all of you to get up <laughs> and identify someone who you don't know. And for five minutes, it could be groups of three, it could be groups of two, but just go around the room, find someone you don't know, exchange contacts and what you do. And then we're going to come back in plenary and then we're going to do it again, two rounds of that. Then we're going to close and see a way where we can all collaborate on technology and innovation for gender equality. Sounds good? Okay, let's get started. So find someone, someone you don't know. Thank you, five minutes.
two more minutes. Two more minutes. Make sure you're exchanging contacts, so two more minutes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You may be seated. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. How, how is it going? Hello. How are you doing? Okay, one minute to wrap up. I've, I've got a request for one minute to wrap up. Um, how many of us have met a new person, got a new contact? Oh, that's good. It's working, right? That's good. Um, so thank you. I'm glad you've been able to interact. Uh, we're going to have a second round, but I also just want to acknowledge our online participants who are also doing breakout rooms online. And so we're going to have a second round briefly, but I just want to get a few of the room, one or two or three people, to just share if they have met someone interesting about technology and innovation or anything new they've learned. All right. All right. Um, so if um, I understand that your conversations must have been super interesting, that's good. Remember, the essence of this session is for us to network and to learn more about the topic and to discuss with ourselves. Um, before we do another round of networking, if anyone has anything interesting that they would like to share with the general room, um, you can raise your hand and we'll pass the mic to you. Anyone? from your conversations, the first round of networking, anything interesting that someone said? Anyone at all? Amazing, I can pass this to you, okay. Yes, hello everyone. Uh, my name is Alan Magezi. I'm a telecommunications engineer. Uh, well, during the breakout room, I happened to have a discussion with a couple of member of parliaments. So our discussion was mainly on how uh, government through parliament can come in and uh, leverage on technology and innovation. So we're getting deeper and deeper, but unfortunately, time wasn't on our side. But basically, that's what we were going through. Thank you, Hufa. Thank you very much, Alan. That's amazing. Um, OK, so we're going to jump into another round of networking and this time around we would give a bit more time because clearly it more time is needed and all right so again someone that you have not talked to previously you have not talked to ultra at the IGF in day one someone that looks interesting to you anyone at all walk up to them introduce yourself share your thoughts opinions suggestions, comments, questions about technology and innovation with regards to gender equality. Um, two or three groups or four or more, but 
try and keep it as small as possible so you can have very close-knit conversations. Okay, so another round um, starting now. Please feel free to interact. Thank you. Two more minutes, two more minutes.
One more minute, one more minute. Um, okay, um, can we start to round up our conversations? Um, I'm going to give you about one or two more minutes to share contact, to take down notes, to um, round up on your conversations, and um, I will check in again in one minute. Thank you. Amazing. And just also to say, we acknowledge our online participants. Thank you so much. Yeah, I, I hope that was, was useful. I, I know networking sessions can be very tricky, but I also want to acknowledge our online participants and just give them a moment as well to see what's been happening in our breakout rooms um, on our online session. Let's see. So just a minute. Um, can we get the online participants? Perfect. Um, I'll give the floor to Hannah. If you can share what's been happening there and uh, any feedback from the networking session there. Hannah, over to you. Thank you. Yeah, we can hear you. Uh, I can see the chat there. I guess we're glitching. <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's see the chat. Just a second. We, we want to make sure that everyone is heard because not everyone could make it in person. So it's very important that we get to interact online. Hannah, anything from that side? She's muted. All right, thank you very much, everyone. And um, once again, before I go into the closing, I would like to pass on to all of you here present in case anyone has any general questions, comments, suggestions that they would like to share from their conversations. Um, and oh, nice. And um, we have a hand raised, please. Thank you. Thanks, Hannah. Thank you very much. Over to you. Right. Hi, everyone. Um, I just walked in not too long ago, but I'm excited that we got the opportunity to do the discussion. So my name is Lily, and I'm in the Ghana Youth Internet Governance Forum. And I spoke with uh, Malkamu from Ethiopia, and I taught his... Um, his idea about what we can do with regards to technology, innovation, and gender was pretty interesting. 
the work he does is um, he's a social psychologist. That's what he says. And I thought that was interesting, thinking about it in the intersection with technology. So I asked what we could do with regards to um, social psychology and just getting more women connected and just the idea of gender and actually technology. And what he said that stood out for me was that um, anything that has to do with technology or innovation has an impact on community. So he feels like if you, if you, if you want to um, make sure that we have an online space that is actually in the service of public needs, and especially regards gender, we have to have governance or policy that makes sure that we are guiding how I mean, interactions are done online so that we do not perpetuate or augment the injustices and biases of fine offline. And I'm like, that is so spot on, right? Because we are thinking about psychology and thinking about how even that relates to the engagement of people in the online space, and that is pretty out for me, yeah. So thank you. Amazing. Thank you very much for sharing. Thank you so much. That was very, very useful. Um, again, before I go on to closing, I'm opening the floor again for one more comment or suggestions. Anyone? Okay. Um, Thank you very much, everyone, for joining this session. Um, once again, our organization, Digital Grassroots, is hosting this session as part of the Generation Equality Forum. Um, we are Action Coalition by the, um, in the Generation Equality Forum for, by the UN Women. This um, forum is aimed at ensuring and bridging the gender global digital divide with regards to gender equality and we have made a commitment to work in the space of five years to see what we can do as an organization to contribute to this work. It's been a lot and it's been very useful to do this kind of events that enable people to think critically about the issues surrounding gender and innovation with regards to technology. So thank you very much. And we have our flyers here for Digital Grassroots. If you want to learn more about what we do and how you can support our work, please feel free to get one of our flyers. And I'm going to pass on to Esther to take the final words. Thank you very much, everyone. Yeah, thank you so much. Um, how many of us met two new people and exchanged contacts? Oh, that's great. Um, and I hope that we can continue because what we recognize as digital grassroots is that there is a lot happening in silos. And what happens is we need to bridge that gap, whether we're working in policy or academia or in the, on the advocacy side, we need to bridge that. And as digital grassroots, this networking session was really about creating that space to interact and just share. And we are a youth-led and female-led organization, so the work we do really is bridging the divide between the grassroots and the high level through digital literacy, advocacy, digital rights. So um, thank you so much for coming. We would like to connect with all of you, so please grab a flyer before you leave, and yeah, come to our booth in the Booth Village. Thank you.